This powerful he said, she said drama recounts the controversial confirmation hearings of Judge Clarence Thomas and the involvement of Anita Hill. Thomas always boasted that he was going to make it to the Supreme Court someday. Now he has. I know how hard this must be for you. All the times this man's been to visit here. He has friends that teach at the law school. If I come forward, it could mean the end of my career here. Well, what are you going to do? Sandra never asked me what my experience was with him. Maybe that's the end of it. What if she calls back? I don't know. What if I give them a statement, but under the condition that they keep my name out of it? This is a circus! It's a national disgrace! And as far as I'm concerned, as a black American, this is a high-tech lynching. 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 Here to accept for strange justice is director Ernest Dickerson. Wow. I'm happy to, uh, I'm happy to accept this award on behalf of uh, a team of talented and dedicated people, two of whom are with me tonight. Jacob Epstein, our writer, my producer, Jonathan Starch, Stephen Haft, our executive producer, could not be here. But I also want to thank our team at Paramount, Tom Russo, Michael Herring, and Ralph Berge. At Showtime, Mark Zacharin, and my guardian angels, Vicky Leticia and Perlina Obukwe. And two great gentlemen, Mike Rausch, and the man who had the guts to make this project and do it right, Mr. Jerry Offsay. Uh, excellent production team, Jonathan Freeman, Jeff Ginn, Stephen Lovejoy, and Laurie Mursky and an excellent cast headed by Delroy Lindo, Regina Taylor, Mandy Patinkin, Louis Gossett, and Paul Winfield. Thank you all for rolling with my punches when I said I wanted to shoot the Hill Thomas hearings as a surreal psychodrama. We all share in this award. Thank you very much.